The back hat allows you to associate a hyperlink to any existing object in the drawing. This hyperlink can be a web address or the path to any file saved in your computer. Therefore, the back hat will automatically launch either the default web browser to open the website or the respective application to open the associated file. Let's see how this works. I want to associate the website to this table object. In order to do this, first I need to open the website and copy the web address. Now I go back to the back cat and click on this button. Paste the website address in this field and press OK. Now select the objects that you want to associate this hyperlink and then press right click to confirm. After doing this, if I hover the cursor over the object, I get an icon of a blocked hand. This means that this object has assigned a hyperlink, but I can't open it yet. To open it, I have to click on the object while pressing the control key. As you can see, now my web browser will be launched opening the specified website. Let's associate more hyperlinks to other objects. In this case, I'm going to add a document file, such as a PDF document, to this window joinery item. To do so, I open the hyperlink command, press file, and locate my PDF file in my computer. I press OK, and the file path will be displayed in this field. Press OK, select the object, and right-click to confirm. I can also assign other files of any application installed in my computer. The backhat will launch the respective application to open the associated file. For example, I have a 3D model of a SketchUp that shows the detail of this wall. To associate this SketchUp file, I would need to follow the same steps as before, locate the SketchUp file in my computer, and assign the hyperlink to the wall object in the backhat. Now I can open this file by clicking on this object while pressing the control key. And also open the PDF document with the window specs by clicking on this window object. To remove the hyperlink from any object, we have to open the hyperlink menu, select remove hyperlink, select the objects with hyperlinks, and right click to confirm. It's important to make sure to keep the associated file in the same folder or location as the hyperlink that was assigned in the back hat. Otherwise, if you move the file to another folder or delete the file from your computer, the backhat will not be able to locate it and open it. If you check the discard path box, the backhat will try to locate the file in the same folder in which the current project is saved. This is particularly useful in case you share the project with a colleague, including the associated file in the same folder.